You can never underestimate what your body can do. Keep pushing yourself and you'll push through barriers. We would have practices and you would have thought you couldn't do another stroke, but your body gets used to it and you do it. Chris Chalmers. Chris Chalmers began his swimming career with the London Y Aquatic Club in 1974 at the age of seven. Coached by Brian Cartledge and Paul Midgley, Chris remained with the London Y Aquatic Club for the next 16 years until he retired from swimming. His earliest memories of swimming include setting a national record in the 4x100 free relay with the London Y Aquatic Club 10 and under boys in 1977 and being part of the Ontario Select Team in 1978 versus Florida at the Hall of Fame pool in Fort Lauderdale. In 1983, Chris competed with the junior national team at a dual meet in London, England, and in 1984, at the age of 17, he placed fifth in the 1500 free at Olympic trials. Chris began his international career in 1984 when, as part of the junior national team, he traveled to Australia for a dual meet against the Australian junior team. In 1985, he was selected to the national team to compete at the Pan Pacific Championships in Tokyo, Japan in the 1500 free, and then he traveled to London, England and East Berlin, Germany to compete with the national team in dual meets there. In 1986, Chris won gold in the 1500 free at the Canadian Championships and was selected to the national team to compete at the Commonwealth Games in Edinburgh, Scotland. There, he placed third in the 1500 free, breaking the Canadian record in both the 800 and 1500 free. In 1986, Chris received a swimming scholarship to the University of Southern California and swam with legendary coach Peter Dalland. In 1987, he competed as part of the Pan Am national team in Indianapolis, where his 4x200 free relay team won a silver medal, and he won a bronze medal for his 1500 free. In 1988, Chris placed second at the Olympic trials in Montreal in the 1500 free and qualified for the Olympic team. He placed 16th at the Seoul Olympics. In 1990, Chris was named captain of the USC swim team. That year at the NCAAs, Chris placed 9th in the 1500 free and 10th in the 1650 free, helping USC to a second place finish at the NCAAs. One of Chris's fondest memories is qualifying for the 1988 Olympics with his parents in the stands in Montreal and then having them and his sister travel to Seoul, Korea to be part of his Olympic journey. Chris retired from swimming in 1990 and entered USC's School of Pharmacy. He completed a three-year undergraduate degree, earning his Doctor of Pharmacy in 1983. Chris married Suzanne Chalmers in 1994, and together they raised three children, Sydney, Marlo, and Josie. All three girls swam and play water polo. They were each named captains of their high school swim team during their time at Seattle Preparatory School. Currently, Chris is a principal of business development at Definitive Healthcare. He enjoys golfing, family trips, and swimming masters in his spare time. When considering the time and effort that athletes dedicate to training, Chris expressed, you can only control what you can control. I remember me and my coaches, we'd hear reports of other swimmers doing really incredible sets or times, and it would kind of play with your mind. You'd think, am I going to be in good enough shape? In the end, you can only do what you can do and be confident in your game plan. <laughs>